And welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us. Today, the finale of this three-game weekend set. It's the Chicago White Sox taking on the New York Yankees. With my partner, Chris Singleton, I'm John Chomby. And we got a rubber match on our hands today, partner. Yeah, the final game of a three-game set. They've split the first two. And regardless of how important the series is within the larger picture of the season, it's a game you want to get up for. Every series win feels good. So we should see a fun matchup in this one. All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. Just about to get started. And Aaron Boone going with the right-hander, Luis Severino. What do you have on him, Chris? Yeah, Boone, last time out, got into the fourth inning. The key to his success today, he's got to throw first pitch strikes, get ahead in the count. I think that'll get him into position to qualify for a win. All right, ready to get underway. Here's Tim Anderson. Tim Anderson. Here comes a pitch. That's outside. And we are underway. And a swing and a miss. Down on strikes. The big righty strikes out the side. Impeccable command in that one. Three batters, three strikeouts. That's electric stuff out there on the mound. the tone early with the fastball 98 miles per hour up on the scoreboard bounced out to short Anderson picks it up tosses to first and two quick outs in the bottom of the first here tonight as we take a look now at the New York Yankees lineup it features one of the sports true superstars Aaron Judge took a pretty big step last year silver slugger award in the American League and now you're on the radar everyone knows it your teammates know it they expect a lot from you because of that success and so there are going to be times where you're going to have to put the team on your shoulders and I know he's more than capable of doing that just things out front so off speed pitches may be a good compliment to that fastball comes up empty on the swing on two okay. now Ahead 0-2 in the count, sure, you've got four pitches you can work with, but throw something you can command and get this at bat over with as quickly as possible. Cut on and miss, struck him out. And good work there as he gets a 1-2-3. Down in order, go to Yankees. We played an inning, no score. Oh, and two as he waves at that oh, one. Man, it's second. Strike three, got him swinging. That's out number two. Nice work there to get the strikeout, and that's a big second out. I'll tell you, this home crowd will be fired up. They can get out of this and leave that go-ahead run stranded in scoring position. This is a big moment in this game. Next offering is foul back. Grinding A-B right here, about to see pitch number 10. Swing and a miss, and that is that. White Sox strand a couple, still no score.
And now it's DJ LeMayhew digging in. Leading off for the Yankees. You know, he's been so great today. Really just throwing whatever the catcher puts down. I mean, hasn't shaken off the catcher very much at all today. Next pitch off the play. And one and one. Oh, that got him. And the go-ahead run is on base to lead off the inning. Well, he's just glad they got hit with an off-speed pitch there instead of a fastball. Man, that would have hurt a lot more if it had velocity. Next offering clips the zone count even at two. Good approach right there. You want to get something just a little higher that you can elevate. Stay out of that double play. Here comes a pitch. Hit on the ground might be two. Quick feed to second for one. On to Jose Abreu. That's two. Now that the third baseman. Josh Donaldson getting ready to hit. Still no hits on the board. One out away from taking the no-no into the eighth. And the righty deals. No, inside. The Yankees yet to pick up a hit here. And a swing and a miss. So he's gotten deep into this game, and at least so far, not showing a ton of signs of fatigue. Part of the strike zone, and he just couldn't get the bat on it. When you strike out on one like that, that's when you start having conversations with yourself, and they're not usually very friendly. Stepping in, Tim Anderson for the fourth time tonight. Now time called. Pitching coach coming out for a meeting as two relievers continue to throw in the bullpen. Jack Green ready to go. He's into the game with the bases empty. Number 57. Jack Green. Righty delivers. Swing and a miss. One and two. Two strikes. One, two now. And a swing and a miss. That's his second strikeout. One, two, three, go the White Sox. And we're still knotted at zero. And he swings and misses, and it's nothing in one. Usually when a pitcher's had a dominant outing, he has filled up the strike zone, and he's gotten ahead in the count with first pitch strikes. Well, that's exactly what this guy has done in this one. Over 70% first pitch strikes. Now that left field. Here comes the skipper, and we're going to see a pitching change in this spot. Michael Kopech. Gives way, and as he heads for the dugout, we'll take a quick break. New arm on the mound when we get back. First pinch running here, Oswaldo Cabrera. Number 95. Joey Gallo stepping in now for the Yankees. This guy with light tower power. In the air, right field, pretty well struck. That's back there. And out of here. Joey Gallo blasts one out. It's his eighth home run of the year. And that gives him a lead. It's 2-0.
Next pitch is downstairs. The three one. Out to short. Counter for Leffa. Collects. Throw to first is in time. Just got him on that one. The battle. The first baseman. The one two. Way inside gets out of the way. And a swing and a miss. And there are two down. Well, you got to be pretty quick with the bat speed these days. So many guys throwing in the upper right. 90s, and you see the velocity on that one. Just tough to catch up to. I mean, guys are coming in, and they're going max effort. They're not looking to go a long distance. They want to get as many strikeouts as they possibly can. Two down, nobody on. In the air, right field. Judge is under it. He's got it. Ball game. The Yankees claim the win here behind some great pitching and defense. All these guys just want to keep it rolling right now. You win this series. You've got another team coming in. And you want to do exactly the same. Maybe even push a little further. Get yourself a sweep. You know the fans are going to be behind this club. They've been playing really well. And these guys, you can tell they feel the energy these fans bring to the ballpark. 2 nothing. your final here in this one. Chris Singleton and our entire crew. I'm John Chompy saying so.